So, do you believe that, uh, well, of course you, you do, believe that uh, African countries need to represent themselves as one block to yeah. maximize? So, so, yeah. yeah, so this, um, I like uh, the, 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 the paradigm that you brought into the discussion. Yeah. In that myself, I have articles that I have spoken about the fact that we cannot keep relying on the fact that we are colonized. Yes. And I have drawn the parallels in, with the Americas and with the Asian countries like okay. Singapore. Be because they were, they were all colonized. <laughs> yes. Uh, India is now in space. India is a space uh, uh, giant now. And whenever Italy, a very old power, wants to send satellite to space, India does it. And exactly. India was equally colonized. colonized. So, so I've made that argument. But uh, the, the same way, I would say that we didn't even need decades to know that we were supposed to remove the borders. Okay. <laughs> Kwame Nkoma did it right from the beginning. He said it. Sorry, sorry, yeah, sorry. Don't worry, don't worry. Yeah. Kwame Nkoma said it right from the beginning. Yeah. And what did he say? He said, look, we need one flag. We need one anthem. We need one currency. We need one army. We need one, one official language or a number of official languages that we can share. He said it. That was in the 50s. Yeah. He said it in the 50s and in the 60s. He didn't wait for decades. And now much of what we are pursuing is what Nkrumah said decades ago. Yeah. So I'll come back to your question that can we act as one block? It is so true. And that was what Nkrumah said. Now, I remember the EPA, European um, uh, Economic Partnership Agreement of the European Union. Initially, it was that they will do it and block. But because of some inconsistencies amongst our own selves, they decided to target each country separately so that the deals were not going to, homo to be homogeneous. They were going to, and it would, it, it would have disrupted a lot of trade amongst Africans. Now we have the African free trade, African, uh, I mean, free, uh, African continental free trade. Free trade yes. mm -hmm. Now what is going to happen is that we, with that, with that block, any negotiation with an external actor is going to be singular and we are all going to be under the umbrella. I know countries like Liberia, Benin, and some other countries have only signed and not ratified, but with time they are going to come on board because they are also looking at their national interest, national economic interest, and how we have to help them survive. Yeah. Because Benin, for instance, Benin is close to a giant like Nigeria. Yeah. Now, if Nigeria decides to flood the Benin market with products, Benin will have nowhere to stand. Yeah. So there must be some trade-offs. There must be some uh, 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 section around the table so that such people will be reassured of some of the uh, shortfalls of the agreement. Yeah. So these are some of the things. Now, politically, we have a lot we have in common, even the environment, global warming. Africa was not a major, or have not never been a major emitter, okay. emitter yes, of green greenhouse gases. Yeah. Our production has been minimal, comparable to the rest of the world. Yeah. So now that the global community wants a deal on climate change. What are the trade-offs? If we come together, we get a better deal. Because apart from the Amazon being the largest rainforest, it is the Congo forest. That is the second largest in the whole world, tropical. And so we cannot sit aloof. There's urbanization. Urbanization means that the people of Congo have to expand. Yeah. And that expansion means that more trees have to be cut. Yeah. What? Is going to be collectively. What are we going to say to protect our brothers and sisters in DR Congo, so that the forest will be left, so that we all live in a happy world? So these are the things that Africa is looking at. Again, security. As an security person, I always talk about security. Now, with security, how are we coming together? Yeah. Today we have Russia in Africa. Russia is in Central Africa. Russia is in Mali. Hmm. Assuming its interests. They are in collision with the, with, I mean, they are, they are on a, 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 a clash with the French. Okay. And that clash can never benefit Africa. 
Yeah. So how do we come together? Okay. How do we come together as Africans? Paul Kagame of Rwanda is doing very fantastic. He sent troops to Africa, Central African Republic as well. And I mentioned, I earlier mentioned uh, Mozambique. Yeah. So if we all come together, and then again, Kwame Nkrumah has said it long ago that we need an African command, a common military for Africa, so that we can salvage our own problems. But then, how do we contribute forces? In the 2003, ECOWAS forces were able to bring stability in Liberia. Yeah. And ever since, Liberia has been stable. Yeah. The Liberia that we used to know in the late 80s and the 90s, where many people were killed, Sierra Leone, where people's limbs were cut, now it is no more. And the initiative was by ECOWAS. Yeah. Led by Nigerian forces and Ghanaian forces. But as you said, there's still more to do. And I will end by saying that in every group of countries, there are giants. And when those giants decide to sleep, the rest will fall asunder. Mm, if mm, I talk of mm, the giants mm. in Africa, they are Nigeria. They are the Egypt. Alcohol. Egypt. They are South Egypt, Africa. Ethiopia, South Africa. Yeah, Ethiopia, yes. And in recent times, Kenya and Uganda are not doing bad, and Ghana yeah. are not doing bad. So these are countries that are supposed to rally their junior brothers or weaker brothers around so that they can have one common voice, the African agency, one common voice in on international fora. And then we will be taken more seriously. And when we are taken more seriously and we are being dealt with, people would deal with us as equals. Because singularly, some of us are so weak that we cannot negotiate with anything better for ourselves. Yeah. 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 See, 